SHOT SHOW 2016 AT uh, THE RANGE DAY AT BOULDER. I'M WITH SENIOR WITH uh, CORRECTION SPECIAL OPERATIONS GROUP. HOW ARE YOU DOING, BROTHER? GOOD, MAN. HOW ARE YOU? Thanks GOOD TO SEE lot, YOU. Stuart. Yep. GOOD, GOOD. Well, LISTEN, WE'VE ALREADY HAD A LITTLE BIT OF A CHAT. YEP. Uh, WE'RE GOING TO TALK A LITTLE MORE, BUT FOR just GENERAL PURPOSES. SURE. Like to know a little bit about you, what you guys do with your organization, sure. and then this this rig. You got this fantastic canine there. Yep. What the hell is that guy? So, anyways, this is Max. That's Max. Um, what breed is he? Max is a giant Schnauzer. He's the um, he was the first correction special ops canine in the United States. Everything from hostage rescue, um, high risk inmate transport. I mean, your choice. Either one uh, a round coming out of here, 1,100 plus feet per second, either that or. Uh, 30 miles an hour and over 450 psi. Your choice. I don't care. It's gonna hurt you either way you look at it. A giant schnauzer. I've never seen one. It's yep. phenomenal. This guy here has a miniature dachshund that uh, has about the same. Thinks he's the same size as that a, guy. Yeah, not as tough. But, got the you know, same heart though, man. He's got the same heart. He's Roger got bigger. That. He's got bigger balls than brains. Let me put <laughs> it that way. That, yeah, yeah. So okay. So uh, go ahead. I didn't. I, I yeah. you know, as you know, so, I'm gonna jump in a little bit. So uh, go ahead. A quick brief in on us is uh, U.S. Correction Special Operations Group. Uh, is the largest government contractor in the world for prisons and jails, tier one operations, meaning hostage rescue, major riots, high value inmate uh, transport. We either train those units, uh, deploy with the uh, agency, provide real time assets anywhere in the continental United States, or uh, depending if it's DOS approved, they'll send us to Israel, Singapore, wherever they, wherever they send us to. Europe. Europe, we'll go there. We'll go there a lot. You go to Africa? Uh, no, we don't go to Africa. Come on, you might need to. Hey, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Don't ask, hey, don't tell any me. Any place, any place anywhere, right? <laughs> well, I don't know at any place. <laughs> Or any time. As long as you're carrying inmates and they're uh, and they need to be put so point A to point B. <laughs> they need to be moved, dealt with. Yeah, yeah. You know, if they take somebody hostage, hey, I clean up the mess. No okay. Problem. So, senior, uh, let's let's talk about. Sure. You know, obviously, you've got your weapon system mounted yep. here. Uh, remote entry. It's very Bio, highly secure. Biometrics, remote entry. I mean, it's alarm cameras. I love the way your rack pops out here. Yep, dude. Eight feet. Yeah. Eight feet, two thousand pounds worth, and she's not bending. Uh, this carries all of our equipment, you know, all the good stuff that, that um, takes us into a hostage situation or a major riot, all the latest technology, you know, all of our guns are all tricked out. We use, um, kind of use the, the, you know, I know you're wearing sun here, but all of our weapons are custom done for us. Right. Um, we carry everything from our cans, get them ready, our, our go boxes, our freaking, um, you know, toolboxes, additional kit, SCBAs. I mean, communications are great. Oh wow! So, you can even do a briefing from the side of the shoot. side of the room. You want to watch the rig? You want to watch Gear Challenge? Is where we go on. <laughs> Put it up, and we're watching it, man. See Nobody really on. wants to watch Gear <laughs> Challenge, brother. Roger. Nobody really wants to watch it. Roger. It's more of a com it's more of a, a compelling. Event. Right, you're Roger compelled. That. You don't really want to. You're just compelled. Roger that. Yeah, yeah. So, so now, can you can you roll this out at speed? I uh, no, that would be cool though. That'd be yeah. a Mission Impossible. You could have like units coming up along the side, tossing things out. You got a guy crawling out the back like a monkey. Yeah. Hey, here's your bag. Go, go, go. We got a little tall platform. Some guy said, "Hey, we actually had one of our operas jump up there and put a uh, freaking lawn chair, got some rays." <laughs> while we were just sitting there waiting over the weekend, like, get out of that freaking thing, man. So I mean, we could roll out with tractor trailers, lots of security, but yeah, yeah. This is our, our what we call our, our correction staff, special applications vehicle. Uh, gets deployed anywhere on the East Coast. We got multiple of these things all over the country. It's done by the Chris Walker uh, at Extreme Fort out of, uh, out of Augusta, Georgia. Amazing guys. So everything on it's tricked out. I obviously can't go into a lot of detail. Right, and I don't but, want uh, to right now. Yeah, yeah. She's not. Uh, you're not stopping her. What? Okay. Uh, can you tell me what the uh, the uh, drivetrain power source is? Can you yeah, mention so, that? Yeah, we're we're using uh, the Ford 6.7 uh, uh, Power Stroke that's on here, the latest one. Um, I mean, obviously, it's got some tuned up stuff that we're running on it. Um, basically, because you know you're pulling thousands of pounds, and I won't go into a lot of detail. But you know, this winch system, you name it, she's got it all on there. Um, we got the FLIR systems on front. A lot of people don't see our cameras, but we got <laughs> multiple cameras front, and back, and we do that. You know, obviously, the high risk transport, we can see crap out there, so we got eyes on board all over 360. Right, right. So, if you um, hijack this thing, good luck, because within seconds, minutes, I don't know, you can have a lot of muscles down your way. Yeah, yeah. You probably more than likely have some uh, version of uh, uh, surveillance system on board for when um, you're stationary. We don't want to go into a lot of detail yeah, on that. But basically, this is a self-contained unit. It is. How many personnel typically gets transported in there? Uh, we'll tra um, so we'll deploy with four guys in here and two canines. Four of your people. Four of my guys and two canines. Right. Always running 
canines. And uh, would that be one extra body if you're trans? Well, no. Would you use this to transport a, uh, let's say, a client? Never. <laughs> okay. But we're, we're following behind. Right, right. And, uh, you know, this is what we call the, the barrier buster. Well, we actually have some bigger ones that are a lot, lot more Mad Max looking. But this gets guns on the spot as quickly as possible um, and as clean as possible. A team of four ready to go. All the time, man. Highly, highly trained. We carry full medic by, um, medical gear by North American Rescue. Our dogs have uh, all their great, neat technology. All the boxes have heating, cooling, uh, camera systems, even their freaking shock absorb. Um, uh, uh, it's like a memory foam. It's amazing. They don't even feel the road bump. They've got there. a better rack than I had. Well, we can, they can hear us. We can hear them because it all goes into the box. Yeah, so you know what I'm saying? They, he's got a better rack than I had. Oh, hell yeah. But you know what? He probably deserves it more than I did. It's like that tempered peanut by uh, Sleep by Numbers. <laughs> That's what it should be. He's in there. Hey, boss, yeah. roll me out. We got two. So there's a divider. There's another canine on the so other side. you've got side. canines on either side. Yeah, always. Okay, good, good. And so we carry our own generator system. I mean, we're, we're, we're completely fully loaded now. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, I don't want to get into anything else about the vehicle itself. Obviously, it's going to have some better suspension than the standard Ford rolling off. Yeah, a lot of weight what rolling have, here. Yeah, exactly. You need a lot, got a lot of, of power rolling behind it. Um, you need to go long distance. So, you know, we, we got to be able to go, you know, East Coast to Central United States and be there in however long it takes. Very so good. As little as nonstop as possible. Absolutely. Thank you. It's almost like, I, I, I don't know if you said it, but it's almost like a Mad Max version. It is, man. A modern version. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, listen, brother. Hey, Stuart, thank you so take much. good care. All right. We'll talk to you real soon. We'll hopefully see you uh, here in the next few days yeah. uh, love, down at the show. Love the gear challenge, man. You guys do good work out there. Well, thank you.